Hi, I'm Colin, and today we're gonna to talk about adhesive bonded fasteners. Adhesive bonded fasteners provide male or female threads virtually anywhere, regardless of material or material thickness. They are ideal for use with thin and light materials, in addition to materials or locations where welding, drilling, or tapping is not practical or not possible. Many of us, especially those who work in metal, have had little experience with adhesive in critical applications. So I'm gonna show you the necessary steps to ensure a high quality bond that will result in adhesion that exceeds the strength of the metal fastener. These fasteners come in two types, studs and floating nut plates. Studs provide an external thread in a variety of inch sizes. If you require a shortened stud, simply cut the stud to length. Floating nut plates float within a hole to provide female threads. Floating is important to ensure that everything lines up well. Unlike studs, nut plates come with this rubber positioner. This is used to ensure that the nut plate is properly aligned in the hole and will be removed after the adhesive cures. All Carlane manufacturing adhesive bonded fasteners are made of stainless steel. The adhesive is produced by Weldmount, a specialty adhesive manufacturer. Unlike other products, the Weldmount AT8040 is a no-slide adhesive. This means that you do not need special fixtures or retention devices to keep the faster in place while the adhesive cures. It is a two-part adhesive with a fast cure time. The working time is seven minutes with a 75% cure within 45 minutes. To dispense adhesive, remove the cover, insert the tube of adhesive into the gun, and then attach the mixing tip. To ensure a strong bond is to properly prepare the mating surface. To do so, simply rough up the surface with a Scotch-Brite or similar abrasive pad. Then, thoroughly clean the surface using isopropyl alcohol. Then wait a few minutes to ensure that it has completely dried and will be ready to adhere. To attach the fastener, simply dispense the adhesive evenly on the base of the fastener. Then in the case of the nut plate, insert the rubber positioner into the hole and pull until it's tight. To ensure a good adhesion, make sure you see a small amount of adhesive all the way around the outside of the base. Technical information, including safety data sheets, please visit our website at carlane.com. If you enjoyed this video today, please like and subscribe.